Oh, we are online already. Welcome back, everyone. I have been working on the story for a week or so, and I written around 21 pages of dialogues, and it's the first draft and everything. And I wish I have a writer who can understand what am I doing. Um, it seems it's really, really hard to attract anyone, especially when you don't ask anymore and expect people will just, just show up and say, yeah, I'm interested in your work. Oh, I want to work with you. Um, and better to try to do a demo. Uh, two days ago. I tried to show my artist how the stupid thing, the screen, will change its um, GUI position when the screen size changes. And I got the code long ago and it screwed up. It heavily screwed up. And I was looking at it today and there were a lot of freaking noise outside. And I discovered playing with uh, resolution, the screen doesn't get happy with all resolutions. And especially if I use the full screen. And I discovered there's a way to see the um, your physical screen supported uh, resolutions list. Uh, and it seems I should test those instead of the fixed one. And yada yada yada. The calculation's all wrong. I need to figure out the right calculation. And the conversation MC doesn't use the GUI name. So, tons of issues, tons of issues, and I was like, ah, and I went and took a nap, uh, instead of doing anything, maybe to organize my thoughts, and I was thinking, when I woke up, like, maybe I should start a stream. So, here we go, we throw up the, um, we throw out the writer hat. Let's start coding. So maybe um, my artist told me once that it's uh, the video get much better with the music because the music is what's make the video um, playable, watchable, listenable. I mean, who cares about my coding? It's the music what's matter. And I understand, and that's why I usually avoid playing music on my videos, actually. But, let's play the usual. Oh uh, yeah, I need to lower the volume. So. Uh, start the timer. Let's list what we need to do. So we might need add another um, combo box for the uh, supported resolution and you tell and see. Let the uh, conversation MC use the GUI names, and if they don't exist, add them to the game file. Add in the drawing a timbury chat box frame adjust the size and location of the chat box frame chat box 
and chat where's the dialogue holes whenever the resolution change and of course when it change from um, English to Arabic as well but let's worry about one problem at a time So, because I cannot figure out which one I should work on first, I will just start with the first one and screw it. Let's go there. There's tons of unbelievable amount of work I need to do if I want to make a game. It's just ridiculous. I don't believe it. It just... The more I work, the more I feel like I'm missing a lot of crap. I mean, what if the player want to play on the secondary screen? That's totally different issues that I never considered and I just saw it today when I was working with the resolution crap I was like oh my god just why why and why so this function will return something called display mode collection and only God fucking know how can I extract the info from it. Maybe it has to list. So what are we going to do? The first step is we're going to add another combo box. And we will call it screen supported. And this combo box should be um, almost the same as this one. Is the microphone on? The microphone is on. Is the timer is on? The timer is on. Is the chat box on? The chat box is on. Here it is. Alright. So let's move it a little bit to the right. Alright. Um mm. Jesus Christ. The combo box still have tons of issues, but meh, meh. fixing them is just for 
to look better for now but whenever I need to do it for the user yeah now this is an issue Oh wow, whenever I click on it, okay. So this is how I initialize the items in the combo box to avoid the problem of null uh, pointers in the dot next when I try to scroll for them because for only god reason no, only god knows why it behaved like that. It adds some null in between of the scrolls if I add them before or after period of runtime of the code. So what we're going to do, we're going to do something similar to the supported. Actually, I believe one of them is not needed, but um, now this is the thing. Um, this is the supported thing. I can turn it into a list, alright, and it's called display mode. So, okay, let's do that. So, um, a list display mode timber display or support a screen display mode is equal to and display mode. Yeah, we could do that. Give me a second. I need to scratch my head. Um, we could do for each display mode. Uh, Tim, me, DMK, and TSSDM. First, we add the uh, key. Ah, oh, frick me. Title safe area. What the frick is that? I wonder what the heck is that? Hmm. I could uh, Google it, but for now, let's do a string. Tim ID is equal to. Um, so we can do. Um, S 
save screen resolution cp fd plus dmk with plus x plus dmk height so we could use the uh, TID here and then or actually we could um, do this and here we use the TID and in here Um, now we use this, but what the hell is this? Is that the, um, this used for EXID extra text ID no that doesn't make sense As I thought it's um, the ID of the item itself we could try to um, to use a smart one pray so um, I don't know how well this thing will work so let's take a look I'm just guessing mostly so this list has 90 oh boy alright seems it worked So let's uh, take a look on my screen. So the smallest is 800 by 600. But here it says 640. I see numbers that not listed. I wish you fight yeah. Wait a second. Nope. I was wondering if it listed both because I see here how many of them 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 This guy has 3 more Alright, 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 alright Let us uh, write them down 
So, um, oh, let's just compare them. 90, 20, this one exists. This one actually exists. Look, the first one. Uh, 16, 18 exist. So it seems we are hitting something on the right direction. Because all of these exist in here at least. Not the same order. But they do uh, exist. Actually, yeah, both of these exist. This one is there. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, so th this one is correct. Now, what we are going to do, we um, either use the same key, same button, or just use this button to do that for now. Then we will figure out a way to make it an easier or more smooth for the user or something. I could, if I select this one, this one just be null. And if I use this one, this one be null. And this key will just, yeah, I could do that. Should I do that? Let, let's take a look. For, for now, let's make the second button do that. Then we will do the first button. Um, do whatever do. So let's copy this. It should work. Okay, what do we want to do now? Select, um, hmm. Can I deselect an item from a combo box in my stupid system? Well, I can remove the curl label. Sometimes I wonder what the hell am I doing?
I forgot who is responsible on selecting an item. Maybe um, clicking on the item itself. That's mean when I add an item, yeah, it's so freaking complicated, isn't it? When I add an item here, it add um. Wasn't the tag empty in the first place? Mmm, sucks. There's a way to delete item, which is not that smooth, isn't it? Oh god. Let's close it before I got a heart attack or something. Here it is. Item action invoke. Remember, the combo box is completely different than the list box because the combo box, when you select an item, didn't I have two add items in the combo box? Where's the second one? I don't see it. When you uh, click on something, you should um, select it. But where did I put that thing? I'm totally confused. This code doesn't make a lot of sense because I remember I made a lot of changes on it. And I remember I had two of them. What happened? Does it magically select the label when you click? There is no magic encoder. Shuck, 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 shuck. Uh, welcome to a uh, confused programmer uh, where hating self is a virtual and no it's never a virtual um, So what am I trying to do to um, to explain why I'm a bit confused is we have two scroll bars to represent resolutions. One, that universal resolution that I would like to test soon or later on different devices. And the second one is what the display support and hopefully it won't crash on different displays or whatever. And I want if I select this one, this one get deselected. And when I select this one, this one get deselected. So I can use one button to apply the resolution instead of having two buttons. The problem is I'm only having one 
variables in the combo box called curl label ID and the curl label ID Wait a second This is the action that I'm looking for Isn't it? Wait a second, wait, 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 this is the action I'm looking for, wow, 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 why, just why, just, and that's what happened when you write a very compact code, I guess. Shucks. So it changed both the dialogue using the label. Actually everything. So what is this label? It depends on... It is the item itself. Heh. Two solutions. Again. Either to hard code everything or add a function called deselect which one is easier well you guessed it Not sure. We have another problem here. We might need to add an extra action for every label, don't we? Let me see. So I might add to the combo box something called select event if you select any items it gets fired so like um, public action select event And here, Shouldn't I do the same to the, the um, list? Maybe, maybe not. Um, so what we're going to do...
uh, let and select event in combo box let if one of the resolution cb selected it deselect the other let apply work on both cbs just to remember the orders of thing i have been working on so in the utail here we will say umc rscp seems like a mad science to stuff doesn't it sometimes uh select event is equal to so uh, pray because sometimes even i'm not sure what am i doing No, 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 deselect. So, uh, this one, deselect this one, this one, deselect this one. And God, pray. God, please. Don't let everyone think breaks, lose, and crash. And, and there you go. Now... Meow. Now, if um, this and this then return, and this is. So if this one is empty, then we will use this one. If not, we will use this one. And if both are empty, it should return before it does anything. We remove this. And... Um, And there you go. <sighs> I have freaking zero clue why I've done all of that sometimes. But because I figured out that uh, the screen actually screwed up when I do the full screen tests on different resolutions, so I was like, maybe I need to add the supported ones for different devices on different screens because I might re use, reuse part of the code when I add it to the options. I don't want to add resolutions that the screen doesn't support as any options games, do I? So I might, I might put a combo box aside in the code to put it and use it and reuse it and add it to the resolution for different games because different games GUI look different but the functionalities should be the same so I can add a constructor just for the resolution thing you know and another combo box for the support yeah, select event let if yeah, let apply work and all of these done so one of the issues we have here is in the um, GUI part
Let's work on that, should we? song with the computer oh this So we decided to be burned by the fan that doesn't exist to use 1024 by 768 So the resolution will look like the screen will look like this big Which will make us poor. I mean it will be hmm Damn, I'm tired. Um, there's a lot of hours need to be done today. Um, there's a lot of things bothering me. I need to do a lot of crab and I forgot to add well this thing shouldn't support Arabic so I need to fix the language and everything I forgot to copy the number silly me Oh, wait a second. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Is the iPad wider or taller? It should be wider, right? I have no clue. I have zero clue. What's confusing me is called iPad Mini. And I'm not sure which one is popular. But this guy says the size is almost this thing. Is this C-sharp? This is C. This is freaking C. It doesn't matter. The matter is I'm freaking tired. 
and my mind is frozen and I need to focus. Okay. So this is the stupid resolution for the stupid things. Yeah, I'm wasting my time. I'm wasting my freaking time. Um, and I cannot even think. I'm stuck. Help! Anyway.
I'm sorry about that, I just noticed my stupid fucking OBS stopped recording from the microphone. And the vid I only God knows when the vi how long the video was silenced while I was working. Uh, screw it, no one will watch the video anyway. It just feels sad whenever that's done. Like, I mean... <sighs> <sighs> I'll take a break because I will uh, butcher the um, configuration for the conversation and I'll try to set it based on an iPad calculation and scale it based on other resolutions and see how it will work. Uh, the font, I need to worry about the font as well. Um, there, there's a lot of things I need to worry about. Um, the um, choices menu, we might have more than one, depends on the situation. There, there, there is you know, a lot of things I need to do. I'm limiting myself. I feel I want to drink seven cup of coffees every second, but I'm limiting myself to have only one per day. So my stomach doesn't screw up like three weeks ago. And I already used it. <laughs> yeah. So I cannot have any more uh, coffee today. It's kind of sad. Uh, anyway, we just add the stupid um, chat frame. And we need to add it. But yeah, we need to screw up a lot of things. I I'm not happy with any of this. I'm not sure how am I going to uh, set this thing. Because as you can see, if I move this, um, how large do I want it? There's a lot of questions. So how large do I want this thing to be? This large? Where's the image? Is it inside or outside? So there's a lot of questions. Um, Maybe inside? Why do I have a frame like this? I don't know! I thought it would be much more neat if I have the same background frame to cover. Um, I'm not an artist, that's the problem. Uh, so I want the spike to get out of the frame. I feel it's look cool like that. We will see, we will see. Uh, for now... Let's take a break, then we will think.
I cannot take some coffee, but I can take some tea. Let's count the cups. One, two, three. Oh, I, I need to stop that. Too late.
Maybe I should leave this to the artist. Uh, let me see if she's here. Just in case. Uh, yeah, I moved the chat box or my conversation with my artist on the other side. Um, frick. Let me close everything. I can not save, okay. Being confused, first of all, let's start the timer. Screw it, this is work. This is work, screw it. Second of all, let's, um, ah, if I, hmm. Images. Alina, go. Let me tell her to come and see my stream. Uh, give you the link. Fuck, 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 fuck. What? No, I am online. Okay. Okay, let me check the chat box. Is this the old GUI? Yeah, this is the old GUI. And let's remove it. Let's move the new one. Alright. Um, let me check how the stupid live scream look like okay I'm there all right um let me turn off the music because I'm confused like hell because I have one billion pages so yeah Azazel shut up okay we said shut up to Azazel now we can focus I just uploaded the image in the Google Drive in the images section and it's called GUI. 
So this is the image. And the size of the sucker is 1240 multiplied by 200. Uh, the chat frame is you can replace this one and this is what's going to be on behind the chat box the chat itself is will be on this guy or this guy so the idea is I'm still working on the um, positioning and I didn't add the frame yet but I will make it to change the side the size and the location based on the resolution but it should work naturally on 1024 by 768 because this is the iPad um, uh, location so what's the idea the idea is the stupid chat frame this red one should should I talk in Arabic and my food they got the shasha bill camel mill or camel in for my food has no but up a little for about a screen for me a team well more about ولكن على حسب حالة المتكلم ممكن المربع الأزرق يكون هذا أو هذا أو ممكن يكون دوائر إذا كان يفكر لنفسه فيبيلي أعيد حجمه بحيث أنه يركب بس هذا المتفجر الغاضب المفروض والله السالفة بايقة السالفة بايقة المفروض المربع المفروض يكون حاجه حاجه زي كذا بحيث انه يكون نفس ارض المربع الداخلي للشات الكلام ده بس السبايكس المفروض يطلعوا برا الفريم از ات كلير فنحتاج حاليا الفريم هذا نفس الحجم بس اذا تبي تغيرينه وهذا المفروض يكون في الداخل السؤال اللي انا ما طرحت نفسي نفسي فيه المربع المتكلم هذا اللي حجمه حاليا 160 في 160 هل المفروض يكون في داخل المربع الازرق ولا المربع الاحمر؟ ما ادري والله بس اتوقع المفروض يكون في داخل المربع الازرق يعني فلنتخيل فلنتخيل ان حجم هذا المتكلم هذا هو هل المفروض يكون اوه اي هيت يو مستر بينت اوف نت اي ريلي هيت يو هل المفروض هذا يكون هنا والمربع الشات يكون هنا أو يكون هذا المربع في الداخل ما أنا متأكد وين يكون شكل أجمل Actually this doesn't look bad as well بس المشكلة المتفجر على قولتي ما بيكون راكب ممكن يكون راكب ما أدري اي احتمال المشكلة هانا ما بيكون كويس لازم يكون في الداخل برا ارتا بتقولين والمتفجر وش نسوي فيه اذا كان في الخارج اكشلي اذا خليناه في البرا بيكون بعد شوي اسهل برمجيا لان اقدر اخلي الكلام يدخل في داخل ده ما اسوي مربع وهمي للكلام يعني بيحل لي اللي شوي اخف بس مو واجد واجد بسوي المقاسات مرتين بدافع ثلاث مرات نقدر نختبر الشيء كذا ونختبر الشيء كذا كان يو ورك اون ات فاحتاج الريزلتس يكونوا موجودين في نفس الصوره اند ذاتس ات
we start painting it. Uh, crashed. Great. Can she still a crash? نقدر نعمل زي ما تقولين درافت ونشوف أول نتيجة أول نتيجة بعدين نقدر نعدل عليها. Alright. Any questions? Yeah, fi lag fi bain al delay. Should I replace your chat box? Of course, if you want. نشغل الموسيقى الحين ينبالي اي كل شيء questions before I Yeah. Do you prefer to do them? Wait. The final result to be page. So my artist is asking if uh, I need all of them on the same page and the final result must be in the same page so the GUI doesn't need to open different files uh, while it's drawing on the screen so it's better to have everything on one page. Um, yeah, so I told her it could be. Uh, done separately, then I add them as a final result to the page. How about to start dealing with this crap? Okay. So she told me she it's better to have the um, character uh, avatar outside of the chat box. And actually that will give me um, an excuse to delete the chat itself. Um, <laughs> um uh, I cannot test them till she finished them, alright? Oh god. Um guess I will draw a temporary one after all, don't I? Oh well. Do you want to see MS? Take a look how I work. You will see MS. And to be honest, I stopped caring for a while. Please resize. Thank you. 
So, um... I'm not sure how large it should be, but uh, let's try to give our stupid avatar some space. So let's assume this is the size. Let's draw one 160 by 160. Yeah, I need to redraw the avatars. Oh wow, 160 by 160. So let's make this one a little bit smaller. And our friend explosion one will be deleted because I don't care for now. So, um, zero, one sixty two, eight sixteen, one sixty one. I could make it a little bit smaller just to fit the pixels, like uh, make it one pixel uh, thinner. Save and save as. Let's replace them in both places. Change the info of the chat box and the um, file. David Hume. So this one has been changed into. Uh, let me put the numbers here for a second. Um, one six two, eight sixteen, and one sixty. Save. Save. Let's move the file. I love this music. Uh, my artist want to show me something. I should go and focus on there. But let me, before I do that, let me move the file and see what, what color do you prefer? Or is it should be to be? Hmm. I hope it fits the uh, backgrounds and stuff. stuff, but for now it is your choice. Alright.
Or you could speak in the um, Discord, but yeah. Mm. Tea. Yeah, let's have some tea. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. I'm kinda not happy to have avatars of a size 200 by 200 while I'm using on default 160 by 160 so either I can scale it and forget about it or I can change it for now I will try my best to ignore it because it's just another variable that's freaking with me So, what I want to do is to delete these three and start over, but for now, let's just do that. What is CGV? It's killing me. Show school box, okay. So first of all, let's add the frame. There's a lot of noise outside, just to make it even better. Chat frame. So we are going to use the, um, you gotta be kidding me. The frame doesn't have a dialogue. It's a dummy one. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit confused myself. Uh, shot frames go. And the layer should be the same layer, which is six, and the go group number six, and the position is zero, and this is the troublesome uh, thing. This should be supposed based on the location of the, the size of the screen we could 
put all the position zero and then call relocation after the um, um the, the to adjust everything without doing the recalculation or be a man and do the calculation every time so um here So let's add the shot frame to um, this fiasco and let's test it. Uh, I might screw up because, yeah. Actually, the screw up is not the screw up I expected to be screwed up. Tell me the f. Oh, calm down, calm down. The object is. No. Yeah, I figured. Super power box. This will give me a heart attack soon. Um, I might not replace the stupid thing the last time. CD2 and 1 I'm looking at it 2 1 2 1 uh, Calm down Ah, uh, the shot box is empty Um Okay, fine, frick me, fine, fine. I will add the shot box. So 
So let's add the stupid chat box before he start crying again. More than I do. <laughs> uh, let's see. We will do uh, a competition. Who will cry more? I will win every time. Oh, what have they clicked on? I will win every time. Let me check the name. Yeah, it's a small B. Uh, let's do the same thing. How large is this stupid thing anyway? On sixty. So it is 180. No image false. Script is empty. Uh, let's put it, let's use it as the chat itself as well. Alright. So this thing should fit 1000. This. Of course. Um. Yeah, I need to make the game start with this resolution so I don't need to resize it every time But that's actually good for testing too, but yeah, 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 I hmm. I don't think these are the numbers I used.
All right. So now we need to do the stretch calculation and make sure this thing is not zero, but somewhere in the front. So my artist asked the question that actually I have been preparing to solve the last month and I should be more um, clear about it but it's good to ask it now better than so how to solve the problem of having different resolution and that's why I made the util tool in the first place uh, so I told her we are going to, we have either two solutions, either to center the GUI or we do different sizes, depends on the location, uh, depends on the resolution. So if the resolution is too small, we have smaller GUI. If the resolution is too big, then we have bigger GUI so we don't lose the images, how they look. Oh God. So, um, I, I, I need to do a lot of calculations here and a lot of patience. So, uh, the um, avatar, let me shift it a little bit. One of the problems is the avatar is scaled already. It's bothering me to hell, hell, hell. 20. Um, hmm. Actually, I believe the height is all right. What next? The stupid thing, yeah. The chat box. Alright. 
Are you telling me that this... Why do I have a box in here? Something screwed up. Um... There's no box in here. Why do I have a box in here, dammit? Uh, calm down. I wish if I can just explode and became a huge fireworks. <laughs> it's just a lot of things need to be done and I am not sure how to do the order. Um, so let me show you what happened when I change the resolution without the recalculation. Mm. As you can see, they stay as they are. And we need to fix that slowly. This chat box is killing me. I mean, the, the, the avatar thing box. Can I remove the chat completely? Does the chat appear at all? Yeah, okay. So we are using the chat box as a chat. We don't need the chat anymore. Yeah, we need to adjust a lot of things now. For some reason, I feel the resolution is way too small. It's killing me. It's killing me. Yeah, what's confusing me the most, I, I use the scaling everywhere and it's uh, it's firing back now, it's firing back really hard. What did I just delete? What happened if I put this 1800? Yep. There is a box in here and I only only God knows what's this who who's doing this box. So it is not this guy. And I don't think this guy is drawable. Oops.
No one is throwing a stupid box in here. What the hell is going on? So one of these guys So these are the choices These are the buttons that represent the choices This is the chat box. This is the frame capture Choices uh, group box the avatar itself which is going to be changed based on the avatar who's talking right right Yeah, it changed the image in here. Um, I'm afraid I left the box in the image. Oh my god. Yep. Oh my god. Oh my god. And I almost lost my mind and it was part of the image. Okay. Ignore it. Completely ignore it. It's not there. It's not real. Fuck it. All right. <sighs> Have a deep breath. I oh frick. I hurt my arm. Where where wait? Calculations. Yes. Focus on calculation now. Yeah, the the the, um, the number of words has decreased dramatically. Maybe I need to do a, make a function later on to estimate the number of words that I can have to make it easier to calculate. Um, can I focus on the stupid location? Hmm? So the location of the frame should be height minus 200, right? And the shot box 180. But this is not the whole calculation. And this one zero. And this one 190 and the avatar I miss this music I haven't listened to it for a while uh, the avatar 
the thing is... Let's test it for now. So as you can see, it's always on the corner, which is the correct result, but it's not stretching because I didn't stretch it. Because we could center it or stretch it. Stretching it would make it ugly, but center it will give a lot of negative space. So I might use both actually. Um, hmm. The avatar should not be stretched, I believe. Hopefully. But the frame could be stretched. Um, the problem with scaling, we are using your float points. Yeah, we are not using exact numbers, are we? Mm. But we can do some calculations. So the calculations should be based on the real resolution with the um, and I need to yeah change the place of the talkers as well that's another story let's focus on the chat box for now then we will focus on the rest should we so um, let me write that down because I will forget in a few seconds So we done these two steps. I pressed end instead of delete. So I did that, but it need more work. It need more work. Uh, need to resize. So we know the size of the suckers. Let me put it on the right screen. So it should not change the size of them when it's a resolution of, let me type it down somewhere. Um, one, twenty four, seven, six, eight. So, chat frame scale set scale. It should be one. If the size of the screen Don't kill me. Don't freaking kill me. Um, I 
divide so if it is double it should be double yeah Seems it's working. Yeah, that's why I should use the um, the ones that the screen is happy with. Yeah, let's adjust the rest and see how it works. What's killing me is the avatar is going to screw up, but we will. We, we, we can uh, adjust the calculation, no problem. It has been a while I didn't see Eli. Computer guy. Eight one nine two. What? Seven six eight multiplied by point eight. Six one four point four. One four. Can I just copy the thing? Okay, pray, pray. This will be a mess. Um, hmm. 
And what did I screw up with? Um, the avatar for some reason is uh, not cooperating. And it crashed. C1 item 3. Oh, the avatar is changing, but it seems the calculation is fucked up. Um, maybe I should divide it over 0.8, not multiply, but if I divide it, it will become bigger. What did I do? Yeah, the avatar calculation is um, the only thing is fucked up, so let's take a look before we take a break. I don't get it. Alright, it seems now it's working, but oh, I hate it. So some of the stupid things are some of the super resolution for some reason doesn't work anymore, and I have no clue why. The location of the avatar is not working now. Calm down. Maybe I need to decrease it by zero. Wait, you tell res, not SS res? What's going on here? Wait, 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 wait. Someone need to die. Okay, calm down. Um, is that because I use the... Um, 
the um, how to rename the smart ID crap uh, maybe um, but calm down I'm afraid he took the item name from the list box, not the combo box. But it doesn't matter. It shouldn't matter. It shouldn't fucking matter because... <sighs> I need to calm down. This is killing me. So the position of the avatar is not working and I want to know what the hell is going on. I'm testing the resolutions. I want to see what the hell is going on. Come on, select the damn thing. So only the, the sucker after this one crash, which is... Um, This one? Nope, it seems all of them working again. No freaking reason. This one, this one crashed. No? <sighs> so... It will be nicer if I lower this one a little bit and this one I'm not sure why it's why it didn't why I believe one forty four. So this one, I would like it to lower it a little bit. Actually, it was one ninety. No, this is one ninety in here. Let's make it one ninety in here too. Actually, 170. This one is way too low. Didn't you say you don't want to change the scale or whatever? Let's let's fix the scale.
Yeah, it need to be scaled. It's killing me. It's just killing me. It just freaking kill. Okay, calm down. So when I fix the avatar scale, I believe it will look much better. And I need to calm down. Use the bathroom. Drink more tea. Calm down. And work more. Almost there. Then I need to deal with the, the uh, Toka location and it will be even more... More problem problematic. Problematic? Problematic. So let me take a break before I break. I almost stopped the stream.
I'm not that too late. And just in time as well, I love this music. Two hours and a half left, or around 160 minutes left to finish six hours. Not bad, not bad, I guess. Let's try that. Guess I got it. The only thing left is the uh, tokers. And this is a little bit bothering me. Because I want something in the center. And I want to fit two characters on both sides. 
and it seems this is way too small than I thought. I might make the chat box um, taller or higher. If I'm going to keep the characters in the same size. Yeah, this is bothersome. Oh, by the way. Yeah, let's finish the Arabic side before we do the talker. So the scales shouldn't matter, it should be on both sides. Uh, the frame shouldn't matter, but these two should matter. First of all, ah, f <laughs> sorry. I don't have a shot anymore, I removed it. So... We could use the shot frame instead. But... We could...
and this Actually, one eighty five. Because it's 160. This is not okay. Calm down. Why this is not? Is the microphone on? Yes. Is not language fixed? What the hell? What the hell? Apply button should be uh, fixed. Come on, select the damn thing. I hate you. I really fucking hate you. And I hate everything you represent. Oh, give me a break. Is fixing the language good enough? I believe so. Oh, you mother... F okay, calm down. I wanna cry. I truly wanna cry. No, not that bad, but I might cry actually. No, no, calm down. <laughs> Why? Why is it that difficult to make it run without crashing? Why?
So actually even the previous calculation is different than the original. So the position of the chat box is 230. Why is 230? Well, it was the width minus 230. So it doesn't make any sense anymore. I don't want to just throw up numbers. Alright. What if I just make it the same? But decrease it by the stupid frame. And this thing this 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 thing okay so the width minus my size oh actually it's 200 so it's at 225 much better Seems we fix it. Even though the positioning is but we can test the position crap after I get the real things. And the font size, yeah. I need to add the Hamza as not connected from before. That's one thing need to be fixed. I need to adjust the font based on the resolution, I believe. Which might require me to do something called font up and font down. I'm not sure which one should be done first. Make 
a function to increase the font size based on the dialog font plus that number for um, MC hmm I need to think about that why do we have a lot of noises everywhere let me close the window That's one problem I need to uh, face. The other problem is the talkers. Adjust the talkers position based on resol resolution. I don't know how to spell that and I don't care and I don't care. It seems it's already get calculated. What I'm trying to say. If we uh, change the resolution. Yeah. I hate you. I hate myself. I hate you, all of you. What now? Did the pointer screw up? Did, do you know what? Do you know what? I, I fucking hate you. And do you know what? If TL is null, then I turn. Fuck off.
So it's pre-calculated, but um, yeah, I need to click on next to do the recalculation. And it doesn't resize them. And their position are not related to the frame. Oh, perfect. It's based on the position too. Can I take a short break before I break down? So, so far the stupid tokers have only two sides, but actually we do have at least four, if not five. So we need to change this sucker. So we need to change it into... Uh, Five, two on the left, two on the right, and sometimes one at the center. So we need five, yeah. So we could, we could um, add them at position zero and do the calculation immediately by calling a function but I'm afraid that yeah I don't want the user to see them at the position zero all of a sudden So I might add them as visible false first, then make them invisible or something. But yeah, the first thing we need to do is to change the tokers to have five sides first. Then we change all the size positioning. Maybe number zero in the center or number five is the center, I'm not sure. Or make it number 0 and 1 on the left, number uh, 2 on the center, number 3 and 4 on the right side. The question is, should I scale them? And it seems, yes, I need to scale them. Uh, 
Maybe I should let the artist decide on the sizes. Yeah. If I let the art the artist decide on the sizes, what should I do next? I need to do something else now. Before I can do this crap. Start on the event system. Yeah. I will stop the stream now. I'll take a break and I'll think about it. Thank you for watching. See you next time. See you soon.